Wow, wow, what a wow. Obelisk Cruiser? I could do a weird Obelisk Cruiser. The Obelisk Cruiser, I have already won with. I'm talking about this thing, right? Yeah. Um, it's a very, very powerful ship, actually. This, this, the stuff it starts with is really, really, really strong. And it's got shielding for, like, extra hit points and stuff like that. This is an incredibly powerful ship. Um, I have beaten the game with it, but to unlock slot B, it says return to the wastelands and defeat the final boss using the type A, or unlock the type C of, this, of the augmented and embers cruiser, as well as the type A of this cruiser. To the wastelands and defeat the final boss. I don't know, I don't know what it means by the wastelands. So we could do that and try and find the wastelands, I guess. So the cruiser was developed by a long forgotten race of demigod cubes and might be incredibly strong. Well, it's just really strong. Let's do it, let's do it. Okay, so we'll go through this ship. As you can see, it has no oxygen system. You got B by unlocking augmented and ember, that's fair, yeah. It has no oxygen, so there's just, like, these things are robots. My crew are all drones, they don't actually need to breathe. So if we get any crew that need to breathe, they just die. So we don't get that. We'll go through the systems. So it has drone control, which is this. It's got two drones, it's got a Mender drone, which will um, spawn as sort of an extra crew member on the ship, and it'll fly around mending stuff as I choose to. This is a drone that'll float around the enemy's ship, and it will shoot a powerful beam every now and again into the enemy ship. It's really, really strong if they have their shields taken down. Um, we have the door control, uh, we have weapons. So the only weapon we start with is this. It requires two power to have, it takes 15 seconds to charge, it shoots three shots. Um, if it hits a room that has a system in it, each shot will only do one damage. But if it's a room that has no system in it on the enemy ship, it'll do two damage each shot. So, uh, it's called Multiverse, yeah. It's it's basically a sequel with a billion times the content. It's really, really good. Um, after that, we've got... You can't really see it under this guy. This is our engines. It's only got one power. That's fine. Um, this is our piloting system. Uh, well, this is a special artillery um, that some ships have different artillery and different ships do different things. It just fires a powerful beam, as it says, it pierces all shields and does one damage per room it hits. These are sometimes good, sometimes not, since you actually can't control the path of the beam. Maybe they'll hit two rooms, maybe they'll hit five, you really don't know. Um, after that, this is a replacement for the med bay, it's the cloning bay. Instead of healing crew that are in it, when your crew dies, they will just regenerate from this. Now, if this is powered down or destroyed or damaged when your crew dies, you just lose your crew. So there is a downside to it. Um, it also heals all of your allies for a small HP every time you jump. So it, you can't just heal them up to feel full between every fight. Um, but if they die, then you can get them back, potentially. Uh, we have shields and security. And we've got our three dudes here. So these guys are all from one race, the obelisk, and this guy is a cocky. Very, very strong. Um, we'll go here. It starts with 45 life instead of 30. It can hold 10 crew. Um, and it's got this ether shield. Extremely powerful shielding powered by an ether batteries. Unlike standard energy shield, it has integrity of 7 hit points. Also boosts standard shield charge rate by 20%. Let's play theme hospital. I don't know what you mean by theme hospital. So we'll start with this. Um, distance swirls. Starts fly past you. Yep. Uh, challenge level normal. We'll just go on with our mission. We'll exit hyperspace. We're in a galaxy. Um, we don't want to grab a crew because he'll die. We don't need another weapon. So we're just going to grab some extra resources. That's nice. Uh, this has been a thing that's been happening recently. Um, there is this NPC towards the end of the game you can interact with called the Judges. And maybe it's from them. I've had this active for like five or six runs and haven't figured out where it's from or what it does. So... But you have, yeah, you take a look at your beacon map. Looks like you still have a little while until the fleet becomes a meat threat, so you can spare some time doing something on the ship. Strange beacon lays nearby. Do you want to activate it? We activate it. Um, signal ricochets onwards into the depths of the space. You don't know who's listening or where they are, but hopefully they're friendly or carrying good loot. Right? We'll perform a task. We're on a salvage mission. Get a random party out there. Get some more scrap. Cool. You're going to bed for a while. I'm reading the notes. PJ hasn't said, oh, okay. Jesus, honey. Um, so we'll take that offline, we'll put this on, we don't need that because it'll never happen. We'll save where the crew are. Oh, the crew, when they're in specific rooms, can help the systems perform better. So piloting 
engines, um, weapons, doors, shields, and security on this ship. Um, if you have a person in them, they will... Um, he's bucket there. We want to go to him. One, two, three, four. Yeah. Um, yeah. Um, they will increase its performance by 10%. So if your weapon takes 10 seconds to recharge, um, if you have a crew manning it, it'll only take 9 seconds. Uh, visit the angry repair fat on Zolna Armories. We'll go to the market. We don't need to do anything. We don't want to sell anything. We don't, yeah, we don't want to buy anything. So we're just going to jump up here to the merchant. You haven't eaten anything yet? Honey, eat your goddamn food that I bought you for lunch. Sullivan, he gives you some random stuff, a bit of scrap. We're going to sell some... No, we can't, never mind. See what he's offering. We're going to sell this because we don't want it. And what we're going to do is we're going to go to our ship stuff. We're going to install eternal upgrade. And we're going to install a scrap arm. So every time we get scrap, it is increased by 10%. It is always the first purchase that I make. Um, it is, there is a lot of micromanagement in this game, um, but you get used to it. You very much do. What did you buy? Yeah, yeah, you get the, yeah. You get the judge, boon judge to do something on board, we don't need to do anything. Um, the supplies aren't that important, but we'll go from there anyways. More lasers here. It's actually not too bad. Uh, it's just from point A to point B in the gap. Yeah, yeah. There's a lot of stuff at the beginning, but you'll figure it out. Hail, if they need assistance. Uh, we'll wait behind to fire off the rebels. That's fine. Um, we don't need the mender out. He, ca he will be fine here. He's only got that. Oh, he's got mind control. That's what this is. Um, the mind control can't get past the energy shields that we've got. So we're just going to start by taking out his weapons. This will shoot here. Oh, you're right. I didn't buy it. You're right. You did buy it, honey. And we may as well have this. Now that it's going to happen. So, yeah. This does one damage to a system runes, but two damage to system lists. So, if all three hit hit, the, the thing will just die. Perfect. Now, if you manage to kill the crew on board a ship before Q, I'll go away. I've already done your quest line. Uh, if you manage to destroy the crew in a ship rather than the ship itself, usually you get more scrap out of it, but it's, you know, if your ship's not designed to do it, then it's a lot harder. We're going to avoid Cure, Cura, because it's it's a quest line I've already done, and it's really, it's okay. Um, we'll rescue the store. Continue. Don't need to do anything last minute. That's lame, but it's fine. He does give good loot. You are right. Um, we are going to activate this here, because this drone is not uh, we, I just won that, um, thing. We found, we found a, um, an NPC called Stefan. Actual, you can change the name of all the crew, but we found an NPC with the base name Stefan. That's fine. Fires don't survive. Excellent. Um, when there's no oxygen. Oh, good. Um, this is a very powerful missile. I love this theme because this does 90 damage to crew. Omni drone and grid are great, yeah. The the drone, the, the obelisk drone is insane. I'm contemplating buying this, but I don't think I need it. So I'm going to just save my scrap for now. You know? Ah, oh, it's... Goddamn beam master. The beam master can't hurt you. He's just stupid. Did he live? Yeah, he lived. He lived. The beam master can't actually hurt you because he's only got a beam and we have. So, beams are weird. Regular shielding, beams can't get through. Uh, the overshield, ether shields, they will deal damage to. So. There's one chain beam that deals crew damage and breaches. That's the best thing for dealing with crew. Yeah. There's quite, like, 
the missile that I was about to buy there does, um, it shoots a missile, it does 3 damage to the hull and 90 damage to crew. Crew in general have 100 health. Some have less, um, some have more, but it's really good. There's this ship that I got, it was designed around sacrificing your own um, guys because you could clone them. Um, you had to literally, you had the cloning bay and you had a cloning device to make more, um, which is cool. Um, there's a ship waiting, sure, loyal part of Federation. They prefer to keep their own turf. Okay. Wait for the tail. Um, native sign language and translator converts it to actual hello. You must be Professor Olaf. Uh, I'm not him. Uh, no idea. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I should. Uh, yeah, we'll accept his challenge and we'll get a Mantis crew. Which is fine. So yeah, teleporting stuff doesn't work through energy shields unless you there's a, they have a certain um, ability, which is they're not going to have this early. There is a um, energy shield bypass thing. But... We have Tom Back Banks, PDTM, Justin, and whatever that is. The problem is with that is I can only have a certain amount of crew. So he'll teleport to me now. But they're just going to suffocate because there's no oxygen. Um, so we get this crew. Who's just going to keep dying. So when he dies from not having any oxygen. Let the mortar charge up. Ah, later. It'll, it'll go off later. So you'll see his health is just going down. Uh, so if... Oh, good heavens, the Federation Renegade. If we turn their location, so the rebels will be rich. Wait, did I just say that on open comms? Ha! <laughs> they mute themselves, then immediately activate their engines. Try to reason with them. Um, the rebel will offer us a glorious galaxy now, multiverse free from Xenos scum. Okay, we'll just kill you now. So you'll see here, he'll die. And then if you look here, he comes here and he starts to respawn. So he'll just constantly die and respawn now. These guys don't even have weapons. They're civilians, but they want to rat us out. So he'll just keep continuously die and respawn. You can limit the radiums per stream, that's fair. Oh, we got that missile launch I wanted to buy anyways, nice. I'm still not going to upgrade anything yet, I'll keep my scrap for now. Yeah, cool. Apparently this is a very strong ship, we have to be really careful about it. Second, yeah, I mean, there's no point, because nothing's going to get through this at the moment. You know? Like, you're right. Very soon I'm probably going to need it, but... I'd almost prefer to just to do up my, um, engines. Yeah, see, look, this guy, it doesn't even matter. He's just going to suffocate. Their shields are down, their weapons are down. Asteroid field wrecks super shields. You're absolutely right. You know what? Come kill this guy. Be useful. Do something aboard the ship. We can only run one salvage. Uh, we don't want to use the drone part, so we'll do nothing. Get him! Ha! He got him. Next sector. Free Mantis or Harmony? We'll go to the Free Mantis. Feel free to do some management stuff, honey. Absolutely. If you get time. So yeah, Free Mantis. Um, it's a friendly sector. Then It's not a unique sector. Uh, there's no real rebels. They're exceedingly loyal to the Federation. Excellent. Um, free Mantis was out in the outskirts of Zoltan territory, but they have been received well. Hopefully you can find some assistance from your Mantis allies, but not have to engage any Zoltan. I will contact them. Oh, I guess our, our one Mantis that we have is going to request a warrior to come join. We got Squishy, who's also just going to be suffocating and dying. Excellent. This is a weird sector. You mesh... For, okay. 
Just examine them. Try to communicate peacefully. Not gonna happen. Mm, you know what? We're gonna upgrade our weapons. I'm gonna get this missile thing armed just in case we need it. Yeah, they're just stacked on top of each other. It's fine. Frazier knows the free manners have been a constant issue for the ministry. Uh, okay. We'll use a drone part here. Oh, we don't have power. That's fine. We'll be fine. Now, ion. So this is a special ion weapon. Ion weapons do way more damage to overshields. These guys will just keep dying. I am going to use a missile he'll just take out the weapon so we don't take any damage. But missiles can't go through the overshields. So we got to take down the overshields first before we shoot a missile. Because missiles, missiles go through all shields normally um, to hit whatever system you want. While these weapons have to kind of go through them by damaging them. Uh, you'll die. There's an event with all the monks. I think it's spread love and peace. Pony Bay gives you a blue option to say that you make the crew die over and over again. Wow. That's rough. We don't want to store. We'll go to the outpost though. Federation outpost. Give us free shit. Contact the outpost. <laughs> Suggest that the free mantis join your crew. We have Beth now. We got three manti just dying over and over. Excellent. I should buy an O2 system at some point. Did I say Mitchell? What do you mean? Somebody with a multiverse drive is jumping nearby. Ooh. Fairy, we claim this beacon for our own. Okay. We refuse to give them what they want. Do nothing. That's fine. There's got to be a war crime. Look, you're not wrong. Um... Yeah, there's no point. Take up the shields. Smack out weapons. Oh, that's not good. Okay, that went pretty well. Okay, we kind of do need a second layer of shields, don't we? Do this. That should just kill. Excellent. Don't look at their stupid faces anymore. We gotta defend the drone. Nice. Second layer of shields there. Feels good. Doesn't block another system slot. What do you mean? No. I mean, like we have to keep the one power in it because if we depower it, they will start. They won't come back. But. It's fine. Defend them from the rebels. Free to, please save us from the rebels. Yeah, we'll save them from the rebels. You got the cloning bay too. This will just kill them now. Oh, I, I mean, yeah, med bay, I think I prefer the cloning on this. The reason why I might not want to get an O2 system is because when people board me, they just die from lack of oxygen, you know? But if I get the chance to buy an O2 system, they're not expensive, I probably will. Because I've got three mantis. Beacon is flooding with system with powerful automatic pulses, yeah. Towards you doesn't seem to care, you watch the ship approaches the massive orb. Hail the leader. Okay, if Romantis leading the group to be a wall, how he's doping from the pheromones and can barely sling out an intelligible sentence. A pulsar hit zaps ship. Okay, now we show. Okay, he's attacking the pulsar. Sure, he's attacking, he's attacking his son. Um, we don't want to sell our missiles. Tell him it's suicide, he's going to try and kill me. Missile can take down the shields and then we'll shoot his weapon system out. They are great at fighting, you're right. 
And like drones are a thing that don't. Oh wait, did that just happen? His weapon system and his shooting just got taken down. Um, does this do more damage to this systemless rooms? No. So we'll just take out your weapons with one just to make sure. And this can just go here. Hopefully your shieldings don't come up first. Like I'll keep the cloning, but I'll, I'll I will get it. I'll probably get it. We were protected from the ion pulses because of our overshield. Okay, we're gonna wait here as long as possible for this ion to go down before we jump. Actually, we're just jumping to a merchant, we're fine. I live to die, some mantis probably, yeah. Ah, uh, see what he's offering. What do you got? Definitely don't want this. This is useless to us. This is a really good weapon. Anti hull three, Jesus. I think I want to buy this, to be honest, because he's selling it for cheaper than normal, which is good. And it charges up, can be shot with that. We don't have to use them. Yeah, we are gonna buy this. That way, we don't have to use our missiles as much as possible. As maybe we might have to. Oh, we'll wait for this ion to go down. Every time they die, as well, um, as as these guys do things, their skills get upped a little bit. So every time a weapon is fired in the weapons, it goes up. Every time um, he dodges something, it goes up. Every time he dodges, it goes up. If they die and get cloned, they lose a little bit each time. One, two, three. One, two, three. I'm only going to get three here because of how I've routed it. It's fine. Investigate the battlefield. Oh, look at this thing. It has no shields. Which means the drone will wreck it, but I won't waste the drone part. The Mantis ship. Look at the Mantis pheromones at least. Can you switch soon? Mine just gets too old and sound like a PC fan. Lol, it's fair. Um, since they have no shields, this can doesn't even need to charge up. It can just keep shooting. Okay, so that's gone now. Mm -hmm. The Manti lived to die. These guys have pheromones? They do. Get wrecked by my pheromones! What I'm gonna do... Is... Cl oh. Clone Bay. Back up DNA. We're gonna... Oh, in Clone Bay level 2. Okay. We're gonna upgrade the Clone Bay to level 2. And then... Install a thing. Clone Bay. Back up DNA. For now. So now what happens is... When it's unpowered, they just stay there. What's Ether Tech? So, usually you don't get that till much later in the game, till towards the Empress. This is a, a super ship. They're like end game upgrades. Like, this Ether Shielding gives you some extra, like, green shielding. Uh, but you can only do it after you've upgraded your shields a bunch. Same with the weapon one, like, uh, Ether Overcharger. You have to upgrade your weapons fully first within your internal systems before you can buy it. Um, yeah. We'll do that at some stage. Uh, yeah. Which means we can take that off because that's not going to go off until we start upgrading it. And we only upgraded towards the end. I wonder if the LED one is worth getting. Who knows? A lone free mantis ship hails you. You are greeted by a mantis dressed in a shirt decorated with 2D tropical flowers and wearing a bizarre beaten sombrero atop his head. Welcome to Beacon. I wish to show you most amazing prize of mine, but you must earn it. Agree. Okay. These weapons go online. You're ready yourself. Okay. He can teleport past green shields. Is that what that's what that's saying? He's got the bypass. And he prefers just keep sending crew over. So waiting for this to charge to four, because it charges up. And that can all go here, and this can all go to the weapons. Uh, we don't need to wait for that thing to charge anymore. So no signs of concern about his potential mind is very good. Humans defeat me. Spare him. Okay. Give me a recyclable. Great. Uh 
going to prove your reactor for two missiles and three drones, sure. Usually they're pretty good to do. That's a pretty good sector. Uh, we'll explore. We'll attack the rebels. Get out Manti. Is it Manti? It's gotta be Manti. Wait for this to charge to four. Let's do it here. This is just take out the systems one shot at a time. Because you can, these things are good because you can wait for them to charge to a bunch of shots to get through laser shields. Or you can just wait for the shields are down if you want to keep things down. You can do. Uh, we're not going to steal the civilian supplies. Oh, there's a breach there. Fix it. Actually, you know what? Don't fix it. We'll get our mender out. Because you're faster at it. So, you can get drones on the ship that do different things. So this guy, he mends things, and that's basically all he does. He mends at four times speed. Um, he's got a bunch of hit points, and he can heal allies when he stands next to them, right? Um, these things, they heal while they're sitting in the drone base if they take damage. But you can power him down, and he doesn't get destroyed, so you only have to spend the drone part once. So this is your resources, your fuel. Every time you jump, you spend one. Every time you shoot a missile, you spend a missile. And every time you activate a drone, you spend one of these. But if they're onboard drones, they just sit there. Union or Coalition? We go to the Coalition. Enter the hyperspace, distant stars, proceed to the sector. So there's a, some... The reaction equal opposite reaction in this case, the Coalition will be opposite... Will be opposed to the rebellion of spiteful and snarky alliance between the four most dangerous races in the galaxy with one goal, to eliminate humanity. Prepare to fight. Uh, okay, that's fine. So they've got cloning, they've got, they want to teleport here, and they've got um, mind control. But again, mind control and teleporting can't go through the shields unless they have a certain piece of tech, which these guys do not. Okay, well, we got rid of enough of weapons, so they can't take the rest of the shielding down. Um, unfortunately, their shielding didn't go down too hot, though. Uh, for backup from ABS, ASB that one. Not ABS. Keep right. Excellent. Get out of the rank of that ABS, ASB. Uh, we can strip them, do something on board. We'll run a salvage mission in the sector. That's decent. Okay, weird sector. Oh, it's okay sector. Um, do I want to do anything? Don't really care about upgrading that. I do want to upgrade my sensors. I like at least having level 2 sensors. One of the reasons is because um, Ethertech, this translator, allows um, Abidian Particles translated of ancient runes. I don't know what it actually does, um, but I like to do it. I'm, I'm on normal. I like to play on normal because easy... I think is too easy and I haven't played this on hard but the original game on hard was devastatingly difficult. This overall multiverse I think is easier than the standard because there's you, you're more likely to get better things it seems. At least that's the, the, the feeling I've gotten. Well he's got to charge up one as well that's annoying. But it's okay. So we're going to pump everything into their shields this time. Wow, that was terribly bad. Um, yeah, we're going to get this out now because that was bad. We don't want to take too much damage here. Didn't really want to spend the drone part, but it is what it is. Okay, so this guy's going to have to keep shooting this thing because he's mind control. Uh, but that's okay. Some weapons are down. Okay, so he destroyed it, but that's okay, because uh, we will not accept their surrender. So when a system is destroyed, it goes red, and you can't put any power into it. Uh, these systems don't actually need to be powered. They just have to be on and functional. Um, yeah. 
when they get destroyed, you can't... Like, if I've got five powers worth of weapons and I have three damage, I can only use two powers worth of weapons. Um, yeah. And it goes off. He's got an ion and a heavy. He, I don't think, can get through my shield, so we're fine here. Like, two laser shields. I don't think this can keep two laser shields down for this to do damage to me. Or four iron, maybe it can. It's not gonna matter. Make sure these shields stay down. Okay. Good. Oh, has he got resistance? No, rock plating. Makes sense. I mean, I'll let this laser go off, I guess. It's only got like another 10 seconds to go. He's not going to get through me. That way you can see it, right? So, you can see it charging here. It's another visual way that charges on this one. It just slowly, slowly gets there. As you upgrade this, it doesn't get stronger. It just charges faster. See, big laser. Uh, deny their salvation. And it just goes across the ship. You can't control where it goes. It just happens. So you can't control the systems it hits or anything. Yeah, we'll go to leeches. Maybe we can buy an O2 system off them. Leeches and asteroids. Interesting. Yeah, like, we'll buy life support. We don't want that. That's not bad to have, to be honest. At this stage. The fire could be very strong in a lot of ways. But I don't actually think it's worth buying at this point, because we're kind of fine with what we got. Alright, sorry, 2 system, yay! It has to be powered. Which means we'll get our, um... Manti back. We gotta wait for this to charge because we're in um, a drone field. I have asteroid belt. Yay, my dudes, they're coming back. You can come over here. You can come over here. And you can come here. Stand by. There's no way for him to think. So now my doors are stronger. I've got an extra thing. Because you see on these, how it's got the yellow one at the top. That means it's manned. So if I take this guy, you'll see the it goes away. Because I can go up an extra level by being manned. Which is cool. Don't really want to go to another store. So we'll just continue on. Loot messages plays over the stair. The beacon is a security checkpoint. Submit to processing. Sure. We'll fight through it. Uh, the med bay, sorry, the cloning bay doesn't need to be powered for you to get um, value off it when you jump. So every time you jump, it um, not bad. Um, it heals your crew based off how many levels it got. So level one was eight, level two is sixteen, and level three is twenty-five, I believe. Uh, these guys are gonna come and get me. Ouch! Yeah, they can tell what's that out. Weapons. He's mind controlled, so he can chill there. These two can come here. That way, we're just going to break through. Okay, the pheromones. Fuck them up. Oh. Oh, they just want to fix that bomb. Uh, I'm going to power back to the mender. Yeah, that's smart. Good. And dead. That can go off, that can go off. We've got the mender on to come fix these doors. There we go. Um, you can come back here, power it down. So you'll see how these guys have 88 and 75. When I jump, even though this is not powered, it will heal them for... Um, you'll see them pump up. Oh, you can't see one of them because my face is in the way. Oh, uh, there we go. Yeah. Uh, okay, civilians, how's your gas? Okay, so yeah, we don't, we have a crew. Oh, we got Kevin! Kevin Fish. It's when the encounter with the pirate led to breaching their life support. Okay, yeah, cool. Um, Kevin Fish, you can, 
You can man the doors. And then you can come to our weapons. Usually you don't eat your mantis is a really good at combat. Um, they inflict 1.2 damage in combat, which is better than just regular damage. Um, so you don't really want him on the doors, because as soon as somebody boards, you kind of want him to go and um, fight them instead of sitting on the doors. Oh, uh, we're in a nebula, plasma storm, that's fine. Um, shields can stay down, that's cool. Because it doesn't matter, because we've got our overshield, which doesn't require power, because reasons. Wait for our weapons to charge up, and we'll just pump his shields, and then we should be fine from there. Excellent. Free Mantis seem lame versus regular Manti. Ah, uh, yeah. The fer see, they've got an ability. Um, activate ability temporarily greatly increase speed and damage. It doesn't tell you how much by, but they go like double movement and stuff like that. So, and yeah, it is extra, mic extra micromanagement, but it's it's fine. Man, the backgrounds are so pretty. Maze are four most hostile races in the galaxy. I know Grandor and Apple Fight. Get those shields up. Should be fine. Let's get a pumpy shields down here. Oh, I don't think we need to actually. Get his weapons down a bit there, that feels good. You can point to a crewman on the ship and it will show. What do you mean? Oh yeah, yeah, if you just like, yeah, point at them, it brings up their stats, yeah. I hate the rock plating, so annoying. Sometimes when you hit them, you'll do damage to the system, but you won't deal any damage to the hull, which is very annoying sometimes. Three fuel now. Oh, the activate button, it's over here. It comes up over here. Tom Banks has one as well, but... His one, you lose control of him, he just starts automatically doing shit, but he gets like heaps of stat boosts. Just to prove myself, well, you're gonna die very quickly, my guy. Sorry to tell you. Big missile launcher. So taking out any part of their systems will do something for you. If the piloting system or the engine's down, their dodge goes to zero, so every shot will hit. You take out their weapons, their weapons can't fight. If you take out their shields, their shields go down. And we got a fuel conserver, which is, yeah, it gives you some fuel, nice. Uh, you just separate us angry. Yeah, okay, that's fine. You can just murder these guys. Oh, they got ASB. Yeah, okay. I think it's anti-ship batteries, what it stands for. Which doesn't... It actually ignores energy shields, I'm pretty sure. Yeah, that sucks. So we got a Mender for this. You come over here. Excellent. Get out of here as soon as we can. Uh, you can't stay long because of the ASB. Just wait for my shields to be repaired. Excellent. You come back over here. When you're in danger, you can't upgrade systems and stuff like that. It makes you uh, get to a safe location. Oh, yeah, loop through. Right through that one. Sometimes these hostile sections are fine. You know? Hey, Mittens. We are gonna activate this this time because it's got stealth, it's got shields, and it's already taken down. Yeah, okay. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Um, 
you're just gonna come over here, to be honest. Oh, you can't come over here. You're just gonna come over here. Yeah, because that's, that's not good for me. Um, we're just gonna decimate this mind control thing. Okay. You guys aren't good at repairing, but you're gonna come over here to repair. You're gonna try and get out of here so you don't die. Oh, we got a cleaning bag. We actually don't care if you die. That's fine. Um, you can come in here. So can you. Come on, Mender. Get our Mender out. You come to Mend over here. Oop. Wait for that bomb to go off. Pheromones can be activated. You can come there. Uh, you go over there to Mend. You come back on the doors. Okay, they pissed off. That's fine. Back, excellent. So I can get it down. Yeah, that's fine. We'll get that up. You can come over here to mend. Okay, that's all. Oh, we don't want you doing that. Let's just do this. That way you run away from that. So the downside to Mantis is they're really good at combat, but they're really bad at repairing shit. Oh, you come over there. Fix my too. It's going invisible again, it's so annoying. Okay, he's back to being fine. Okay, this is a very annoying fight. You've done that, you come over here. Okay, let's take out this fucking one. Excellent. God, that, did that O2 die again? Jesus. The goddamn teleporting bomb. Okay. That's fine. You guys can try and get through here for me, please. He'll respawn. Wait for this to come up. Okay, she's dead. No, are you serious? That's so but that's so lame that that just happened. Okay, that's fine. You come over here, help prepare that. That was such bad timing. Thank you, okay. You come into this. Alright, what we're gonna do here is these guys. Um, you guys, I'm just gonna kill you guys because... You may as well just be at full health. for uh, the next part. That was uh, spicy. Uh, Menda, you come back over here. Be powered down. Hmm. What do I want to do? I think we need a little more dodge here. I think the next thing we need to do is maybe upgrade weapons and drones or whatever. But we're okay for now. Okay. That was a spicy fight that I wasn't ready for. Admiral Vance, some kind of personal grudge. He's got one layer of shield. What? That's interesting. He's got all the drones there. Alright, honey, you have a good night, okay? No, are you serious? I don't know if this guy can get through the shield, so maybe it's okay. Okay. Do you think your channel will actually transition to Warforge? Yeah, I think so. It depends. I mean, we'll see how things go, right? I'm never going to say anything for sure, right? Because you never know. You're really back to your positions. Oh, have a good night and I love you, baby.
Jesus Christ, what the fuck is this? As soon as you arrive, you're ear bleeding loud advertisement blasted through your ship, stare at potential shoppers, Hector Industries is proud to announce the arrival of our new Hector brand military supply depot over to all coalition ships or anyone else willing to give us money to come in. Okay. Go and shop, shop, shop. Another brainless idol. Oh, no way, that's that's right. Another brainless idiot who'll give us their money. Welcome to Hector in Okay. Do we need anything from you? No. A few repairs is probably in order here. I assume legions will die out. Maybe. We'll see. And maybe it'll, to be honest, I'm potentially it'll bring more players to legions. You know? We'll explore. We'll attack the slaver scum. Good night, Dynas. That's exactly right. I love you, baby. Sleep well, okay? Okay. Mittens. I haven't moved. I'm done with that. You can just run away. Okay. You can't go invisible anymore. I right, now you come back in here and you just run around so it's not hitting the system. Excellent. Wait, there's a finish. Good. There it is. Ooh! Do we need you? Nah, fuck that. She's downstairs. Prefer the scrap at this stage. Okay. Next sector. Vagabond, Rimworlds, or Harmony. I've been to Harmony so many times, we're gonna go to the Vagabonds. They quickly pass you by, do something over the ship. Yeah, we'll get two, two fuel back from that, that's good. Yeah, this is this is a cool place. See, this haunted riddle with supernatural. In reality, it's just a bunch of unfortunately named gas beings known as ghosts. They certainly aren't spirits of the dead, but the Vagabonds hold no allegiance to anyone. Prepare to fight? Yeah, they're ghost people. That's cool. You wanna get mittens, don't you? I really need to get my weapon systems upgraded or whatever at this stage. We'll get this drone out because if we take out his weapon, the drone will do so much work. Throw shields. The drone will just fuck him up. If it hits a systemless room, it does four. You know? Mid ends! Oh, the missile shot and hit it. That's so lame. Kill. Cool. Nice salvage. Get some extra stuff. Hello, mittens. Oh, do you want to be picked up or not? You looked at me like you were okay with being picked up. I don't know if she wants to be picked up. Minions! Say hello. Yeah, it'd be like that. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Um, I think we go up. Up could be good. Scanning nearby gas giant, but quickly hails you to jump in. Isn't my darling beautiful? Okay. Yo, here, don't be silly. You can see she's quite large. It doesn't take long to realize you're referring to the gas planet. Okay. So you can do me a favor. My darling hang hungers. I must feed her, but I like the food. I must bring her a wreck. I heard a demon lingers about, but perhaps you prefer to go after some rebels? Let's go after demon. Okay. Demon in question, order ship. Okay, I have to kill either way. Get ready to fight. Sure. Again, we'll just munt those shields, hopefully. Hmm, that's a lot of uh, ion damage there, my guy. Mm. 
Damn it. Didn't get three shields. Not enough anyways. It means it's a lot more user friendly than when we first bought her. That's fair. It's a fair assessment. Alright, I got enough missiles to actually start using this missile thing, so I need to upgrade these my weapons. So I can start using the missiles as well. Okay, there we go. Now you murder everything for me. Four, Jesus. That's so much damage. I uh, bring the ship back. Get a thing. What do we get? Standard amp drum that fires f energy projectiles more powerful, increased damage, and increased movement speed. Okay, yeah, cool. Uh, we need to up it by two, which we can't just yet, so we'll wait. We'll wait. Wait for those iron to go down. Which will happen eventually. Ba -da -ba -ba -da -ba -ba. Okay. Distress! Nice. Yeah, yeah, it's been a year, hasn't it? Look at an orchid ship of all things, source of this distress beacon. One of their crew hails you, please help. We were sent here by the gather. We gather gathering to negotiate with the ghoul clan who kept burning our colonies, but our captain was taken hostage. Agree to help. To just switch over to a vagabond war camp to play by mostly ghouls, you request to speak to their leader. Um, does the life of the frail plant thing concern you uh, to a degree that would drive you further ambitions to seek our favor in release? If you wish for the fall of being not to suffer any longer, then you must prove you're worthy and destroy a dynasty vessel who has been troubling my people. Yeah. We'll smack it. Destroy this thing. Aww. Dear ya. Oh man. Yeah. So your senses don't work when you're in Nebula, which I always hate. Oh jeez, nice shot. <laughs> you <laughs> um no match me, I hope they won't go back on their promise, seem willing to uphold the end of the bargain and release the Orchard Captain, once they safely return, the pay you. Nice. So we got something we're not going to use because this is better, but we can probably do this now. Excellent. Start using our missiles. Don't need to go to the store. Lifeform scanner is cheap. Yeah, but it's not really worth getting. Just get a slug crew member. Oddly enough, none of the ghosts are attacking the slug, nor the slug scrapping the wreck. Hail them. The slug captain... Responds in frustrated tone, since it looking around himself on occasion, turning around to yell at his crew. Uh, and we recently taken up to breeding ghosts. Turns out they don't like, they don't breed. Well, uh, unfortunately, we don't have enough for that. Would have liked a ghost crew member. They're cool. Yeah, slam dunk. Okay. Uh, they're typically aggressive alive. Okay. Yeah. They're coming to get me. Sometimes it's just destroy the ship. He's almost as good as we need. Excellent. Oh, this guy's got fuck all hell. Jesus. He'll just die. Jesus. Excellent. We are going to need some more power here, though. That way we can have a drone up as well. Yeah, get some stuff. Um, just sitting by. We'll scrap it. Why would we not? Oh, yes! The thing we kill to get a fleet delay by one. Engage the outpost. Okay, they've got whatever this is and a big laser. So we use this to take out their shields first, and then we'll just obliterate them somehow else. These child supports. Each. This thing's powerful, we definitely have to deal with that. This can go here, and this can go here. Excellent. And this can just hit that a few times. 
Ah, uh, yeah, okay. Those things just gonna die very quickly. Bom, bom, bom. Definitely went past the dynasty. Yeah, the dynasty. But what are you gonna do? And they delayed the fleet. Yeah. King of the Virgins has a child. Your baby's name must be Jesus. What? <laughs> The hell are you talking about, honey? Uh, get another one of these. We'll upgrade this by one because we can't. Oh, do we do this? So the base cooldown is 50 seconds. So it's like more than that at the moment. 1.25. So 2.5 of that is like, it's like 60 something seconds at the moment. We're just going to get two bars of power for now. And we can jump around a bit. Oh, yeah, so not a ship. We'll they're trying to get away, are ya? Okay. Just gonna go there. And these laser drones are so annoying. Okay. That was real lame. Jesus, okay. Uh, Menda. That's on fire. You come over here, help with the weapons real quick. Come over here. The FTLs are still charging, so we're gonna have to take out their, um... Do we six? Yeah, we're gonna have to. No way, can't. Uh, you come over here now, please. You go back over there to help with that. This can come here. And I can kill that. Excellent, okay. A little bit dicey there, but it's fine. Get ready back to your positions, thank you. That can be turned off. Eh, we'll still just keep jumping around. Hello Traveller, I am Dominus the... Dominus the Explorer, privy to all knowledge that one might need on these dark, nebulous clouds, all except the one fatal fact of whom eludes me. I have heard the legend of the so-called Acid Nebula, yet I've never heard of seeing one myself. Uh, I'm not sure. Could you describe one? Wait. They're, well, they're of green hues, and they're nature, the nature of the nebula, that's really it. Telling the truth, you never see one? All right, okay, we've got some stuff off him. Cool. Um, jump over here. Fight the ghosts before they can damage your system. Ah, uh, you can see the footsteps echo through the walls. You hush to the engine room. You see three ghosts bent over examining the FTL draft. Wait and see. Oh. Damage to my hull. Intrudes on board. Get the Mender drone out over here. Where are these ghosts at? Oh, they're there. Look at that. Okay. Get all these pheromones out. Get every these three guys in here to mess these things up. Okay, excellent. And... I mean, we'll take our time. We've still got a bunch of jumps. Become accustomed to not seeing many Federation Sprenies. So one here comes as quite a shock. Oh, even wider, there's weapons are powered and hull show some minor damage. Oh, well, they're going to be ghosts. There's a cousin looks up, distracted. Oh, well, look who it is. I thought you were all alone in this cloud, safe for, for the ghosts. Um, was trying to clear out the camp. Um, of them, not too far from here, bastards are stranded. Um, well, I just keep taking trips back and forth as much as I like. What? I thought we were all alone in these clouds, save for the ghost, that is. I was trying to clear out a camp of them, not too far from here. Bastards are stranded. Well, they're stranded, why are you killing them? Have a good night, Dark. Have a good night. But why, oh, well, easy scrap. Okay. Um, they're evil feds. We're going to kill these federations. Guys. We're federation, by the way. Hell, I don't know. It's fine. Um, but that's not okay. So, this is an EMP drone, right? Yeah, let's get the EMP drone out. You can change this thing to give it more power, so it EMPs for more and stuff like that.
Bye bye, Federation. Fish in a barrel. Ah, uh, this should be upgraded probably very soon. I'll wait till we get some more scrap there. Hmm. The Vagamons and I work together, but this is the best interest until the random ship come in and claim their territory. Looks like a ship he wants to avenge the guard to kill. Yeah, that does that. This can go here. We must have some boarding drones. That means this can just kind of shoot here. <laughs> okay. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Excellent. Terrible remains, good. One, two, three, four. Good, we can do that. Perfect. As the comic started in nebula sectors, but they are drawn to the ghost. Never the neutral enemies land as prey on the ghost to absorb their ships. Landers here don't care about you, not the ghost. And attack regardless. Okay. Alright, honey, you have a good night, alright? And I'll see you in the morning at some point. See, better. Uh, ghost, no, we don't care. They never belongs to the uh, Keplocracy and the EHC, not the ghosts. Okay. Fight me if you wish. It's not going to end well for this ship. This ship is not strong. It's got a lot of weapons, but 12 hull, 2 shield. Jesus. Uh, do we accept their surrender? We get a thing. I like things. Yeah. As you deploy boys during jumps to eat. Yeah, you get an extra thing. That's pretty good. I'll take it. Good baby's on the screen. She's not in the room anymore, but I will. Can't quite make out. Looks like the rebel ship is here. Looks like a rebel ship is here waiting for you. You can't quite make out what the ship is though at first. Ah, uh, it's Lee again. Leah. Here we go again. Lots of beams. All, all that's good is beams, so I can't get through my regular shielding. Bean Master. A giant pain in the ass. But she, she keeps teleporting away. Our arch nemesis. Yeah, I know. I've, I've beaten that ship twice. It's rough, though. That's an interestingly strong ship. Intervene to defend the outposts. Okay. Hit your shields. And we'll just be able to kill you from there. These drones are powerful. Okay. Good. Thanks for helping. Get more. Good. Next sector. Free Mantis Domain. Well, we've got a bunch of Manti, so that should be alright. Uh, do something. We don't need the fuel, so we'll get an extra... Just free delay. Get to the sector. It's good. Find aid, contact the guard, have your free mantis. Oh, we got another manti, look at that. Excellent. Where'd you go? You're here. You're, yeah. Um, you can go, wait. You come over here and you can come over here. Okay. 
What's our first jump? Distress, okay. We have a lot of scrap, but I'm just kind of waiting for something to be worth spending on it. We eagerly request you to our chief. Has been captured by. Please save him. Okay. We'll save him. All the way over there. Jesus, okay. Now we'll go over there now. May as well. Prometheus are uh, three rebel ships. The guns blazing. One of them spots you and attacks. Okay. Very powerful. It's very good. When their shields are down. Do we want to go to this store? Probably not. Not yet. Do something aboard the ship. Perform a task. We'll get the salvage mission. Salvage mission. Not too shabby. Mm. The good thing about drones is they fuck up energy shields. So by the time you're ready to shoot your weapons, the energy ships are gone, so you can shoot your missiles through it. Unless he misses, of course. Yeah, this thing's gonna die very quickly. Huh. No. Bonk! Downtown. Uh, do nothing. That's okay. Look, you three, come beat up this guy. Thank you very much. Back to your positions. They have a cloning bay though, so it'll come back. This hit the shields. That way, that thing can just mess everything up. Okay. Mender, come over here. Get out of there. Invented. Okay, you come over here. Okay, there we go. So far, so good, this run. The ship is very, very strong. Sensors to scan the wreck, get stuff, good. Okay, quest. What was that quest again? I can't even remember. Found the ship, they seem to know you're following them, or maybe just really angry because you attacked them as soon as they entered the system. Get ready for combat. Are we supposed to destroy this ship or just kill the crew? Can't remember. Either way, it's not really going to matter, because we're just going to have to kill the ship. It is what it is. They've got a charge weapon, an ion weapon, and they board with four, so... These guys are going to be ruined in a second. With one of its prisoners too, you scrap the ship and hope the Freemantas don't hear about the mistake. Yeah, I wasn't supposed to destroy the ship, but there was no way I could have not, so... I got so much scrap, I just need another, like, weapon or drone that I can justify spending this shit on. Oh. It's a big ship. We'll fight them. Unfortunately, uh, ever since I injected the DNA of the pollution in the melon plant, some of our stream have begun to see visions of the future. So far, not a single one of them has come true. Nevertheless, in one of them, I vividly remember a ship like yours killing me. Well, not exactly, but it was close enough. I'm afraid I'm going to have to kill you instead to prevent this fate. So, high-level threat, they have gas, so don't board them. And this is, if you destroy the ship, there's a 50-50 chance of you getting a cool weapon. But if you kill the crew, you just get it. So, but I have no real way of... Um, 
not just destroying the ship, unfortunately. Hmm. What does this do? Toxic laser of some kind, okay. That's okay, we get more scrap out of it, so it's fine. Fix up the thing. Go back there. Well, we may as well go to the store, see if we can't buy a weapon or a um, drone or something that's good. Volunteer to stand guard? Yeah, fuck it, we'll do it. We may as well. Oh, we also get to buy stuff before the fight. Hmm. I'm thinking cloaking. We'll get cloaking. We'll also get backup battery. But I don't want either of those, and I don't want any of that, so... Now oh, may as well go invisible. Mm, get this up. So can come here. Let's go over here. Just to decimate that. They're trying to run away, that's fine. Nope. They can go invisible, that's cool. One of them hit. Yeah, that's kinda lame, but it's fine. Just go invisible here. Yeah, we just murder them, because we can, effectively. Okay, uh, oh, that's bad. We're gonna have to fight some, uh, rebel ships with an ABS, but it's okay. Showing intelligent life forms in the pipe plant, no match can be found in daily rest. Investigate, try to communicate peacefully, doesn't matter. Um... Upgrade the laser all the way, and maybe we'll actually see it. Continue, do nothing, it's fine. Uh, use this on your shields. May as well, well, we have heaps of missiles and shit. I don't know why I'm trying to be stingy. Um... This powered up, I suppose. Go invisible. That way the ABS hopefully misses up while this drone takes out everything. Oh, it still hit us. That's kind of lame. Oh, there you go. Look at that. Look at it go. And, uh... Can't fix this. Just got opportunity to use translate. Nice! I still don't think I have. Spectral Wastelands Coalition Strongholds. Let's go to the Wastelands. Fight some more ghosts. Do something on board. We have enough fuel, so we'll just delay them a little. So it's a unique sector. Um, how available bounty for being solicited for rebel vessels? Nice. Um, Vagabond clan sector belongs to dynasty, but for some unknown forces came through here wiping out most of their colonies. All that remains are scavengers. Okay, cool. Still the sectors. The story for this sector still fascinate you to this day, long before the Federation was once ruled by the Spectral Dynasty B, but from nowhere some mysterious force wiped them. A particular, uh, pr practically every ghost from the sector from existence, you wish you could ask the ghosts themselves, went down. Okay. Uh, try and escape. No, we don't want to try and escape. I'll just fight them. I'm okay with fighting them. 
come over here. Let's drain up. Hopefully we can go invisible as they shoot, but we'll see. Oh. Pheromones, pheromones, pheromones. Come here, murder the shit out of that guy for me, please. He did just shoot just then. We'll go invisible. Back to positions, please, guys. Did he just shoot? No, he didn't. Okay. Man, there's a lot of goddamn things on this ship. Ooh, okay. Very powerful ship here. Needs to be fixed in case anybody dies. Let's go invisible real quick to be careful. Okay. Oh, that's a powerful ship. We gotta be careful here. Time to upgrade some shit. Do something aboard. Salvage mission. Get some stuff good. Okay. Where are we looking? Over there. That's fine. We'll get this mender up. Everybody back to where you belong. You can fix this. Okay. You're almost dead, so I may as well kill you. And we guys can come back with full health. Okay. We definitely need to be careful here. So stop upgrading this. And be careful. Unfortunately, these guys who are immune to suffocating... Um, you can't really just kill them to get them back to full health at the cloning bay. Ship of all things. Okay, agree. Um, we'll fight the ship. Man, these drones are annoying. I had an anti drone thing. We're just going to go invisible here as well to stop these guys from taking out these shields real quick. As much as we can, at least. I'm gonna get an EMP drone out, and then we'll shut it down as soon as the shields are all the way down. Man, these laser drones, Jesus. Okay, we're gonna use all these just to take out the weapons here. We'll take this fight a little bit slower, you know. Go invisible here too. If we take it a little slower and just don't and decimate the weapons first, it'll go, this will go better for us. Especially because of that. And dead. Uh, excellent. Hopefully the ones went back on the present. Yep, good. We got the thing. Excellent. Good store. We can heal and sell some shit. Um... Need some parts. Sure, we'll buy a thing. Sure, we got a missile we can sell for 22. Well, profit. Um, fuel can go, verter can go away. We're not going to use that. We'll never use that. We've got better stuff than that. Um, hmm. Wait, we've already got long range scanners. No, we don't. Okay. We don't really want any of this, so. Buy a bunch of health. You want to sell that? We don't really want any of that. So, what we will do is upgrade this by two. Buy last one of those. That way we can have two things activated here when we need it to. 
Not to mention we have um, our backup battery for temporary power to use for our cloaking. Uh, cloak. Okay, I'm gonna give. Um, so this is gonna go down here. I'm gonna power up these two. This can come here. It's got no drones, so we're gonna go stealth when we need to. After he shoots. Okay, good. He shot two of his weapons. And we'll miss because we're stealth with 95% evasion. Send the missile to here. We will take out these shields this time. These weapons aren't as powerful as the last ones. Keep you fine. Keep you fine. This laser will go off at some point soon, which is nice. Excellent. You're wrecked. Right. Figures the final moments before the brilliant blue glow ceases their integrity. Yes, that's what we want. Um, well, we're just trying to like, look for distress beacons or whatever here. The motivation vessel confirmed is implied. Your allegiance prom prom yeah, promotes your ability to assist currently at a large separate saboteur. Sure, have eluded capture from harmony for too long. Request federation vessel holds off criminals until enemy forces can arrive. Sure. Over there, okay. Well, we'll make our way there slowly. It's probably the last thing we want to do before we leave. Ah, okay. Oh, shit. That's a big ship. Um, the beacon was that we activated earlier. Ah, interesting. Over, okay, well. Very interesting. This is the beacon from the beginning. I, I'm glad we encountered it. shields. That way the drones can take care of everything else, basically. Yeah, he's already into five. Excellent. We have no way of actually killing all the crew because we've got nothing to board with. Uh, okay, so you, you, and you come here kill this guy. Uh, we didn't get the weapon, that's fine. Just let you win because it's faster. Okay, back to positions, ladies. Our ship is quite strong right now, and I like that. Um, what do we need? Interesting. Give him the scrap to fix that hull. Oh, we got Thomas! Hello, Thomas. You provide power to a system. Um, yeah, come stand down here. You good at doing anything? You good at... So you are here, you're extra good at that, so that's fine. All right, you provide power to the system. All right, maybe? Oh, you're a ghost. Oh, you're a ghost, never mind. Takes no damage from hazards, 80% health, has door facing, periodic ability, um, opens a breach in the car room only, opens when HP's below full, okay. You don't want to be there, actually. You can stand here. I think. No, you can go there. This is, you can go over here, where you're not going to be in the way. And if you cause that breach by accident, it's not going to screw me over too hard. Man, the backgrounds are beautiful. Beacon uh, might not be any meaning nebulas other than those far from the north, but it does have a large vagabond camp set up on a nearby planet. Brief scans show the inhabitants are moving about quickly. Hail the camp. Um, a storm approaches. Check the store. Perform a task. Um, yeah. Well, we got this thing to destroy, I guess, which is good. Delays the fleet for us. Engage. And again, activate both of these. Power this up. Use those things to do stealth. That way this isn't taking down my shit. Okay. 
Okay, this goes here. This beam drone man messing my shields up. Positions. Okay, okay. He'll go stealth longer than me, but it's fine. Uh, okay. Um. Excellent. They won't be pleased. Who cares? Okay. Doesn't matter. Positions, ladies. Ah, uh, we'll go to the store. We got a bit of scrap. Sure. Um, let's see what they're selling. We already did that. We don't want to repair. We do nothing. Okay, so selling. Nothing really to sell. Nothing really to buy there that we like. Defense three. It's almost worth buying. It's so good. 150 millisecond reload time is not terrible. It's so good at destroying everything. There are better stuff, but we're gonna buy it. We're gonna buy it. We'll sell this one, and this can come here. Um, as much as that EMP drone is very, very nice. That's just way better. We do want two more of this when we can get it. That's fine. Um, so we'll just kind of chill out for now. Taking a long way to this quest. Surrounded by several vagabond ships. Oddly enough, none of the ghosts attacking them. Hail them. Uh, slight captain responds in a frustrated tone, constantly looking. Um, approaching to the occasionally turn around to his crew. Yes, your federation, we're a science vessel and we're recently taken up trying to breed ghosts. Turns out they don't breed. Okay, so we can buy the thing or we can have ghosts explain. Types of response to small tablets so the slug can understand according to them the ghosts age through the collection of natural gases they assimilate into the body. Once they reach maximum size, they become known as alpha. Once in the alpha stage, they can divide to create new ghosts. Oh. This doesn't make sense. This business isn't right place for me to say. Okay, so we get an extra crew, but we're going to have to let somebody go. He's an alpha ghoul. Okay, a powerful ghoul, the end of his lifespan and heavily unstable. Um, inherited phantom status, takes no damage from hazards, can face through doors, is kind of slow. Uh, periodically lights a fire. Okay. Maximum health 110, two, double sabotage speed, unstable, nor the ignition ability occurs more often, only triggers below 110 HP, can divide, add an empty beacon to create two standard variants. Interesting. Well, we probably don't want that, um, but I think we let you go. We don't really care for the leech here. I think the um, this is more interesting. So you can come on the doors. And you can come here. We'll jump over here. Become the accustomed to not seeing many fed ships hail them and they're killing stuff, so we will attack them because it's evil. They don't like me, it's fine. Um, we not, don't need to activate that defense drone. We don't even actually need to activate any drone this time. I think we'll be fine against this ship. Like, it's, just, it's not going to be able to do fuck all to me. It's not a very powerful ship. Okay, good miss. Well, at least this, this will do something this time, at least. Meow. Oh, good, good hits. Excellent. Wow, I wasn't expecting that good of hits from it. To stop for fuel, we don't care. Goodbye, Federation vessel. Good. Nice. Uh, wait for this to go down. These guys are stunned. 
a few seconds, but that's fine, because that'll go down. They're okay to be stunned for a millimeter or so. A few seconds. Like any of you ever seen entirely black and cubicle skeletons of a few massive warships remain to speak, and maybe you can salvage something here. Um, one of the vessels, attack, nothing, it's fine. Um, we are going to put this defense drain up this time. Wait, what's it set to? Shooting faster than Mark II. Capable of targeting lasers or projectiles. It's... Oh, it does both. Okay. So yeah, we're going to go invisible now as well. That way our shield... Oh, God. It took so much from those two lasers. Whoops. Should have been quicker on the mark there. That's all right. This should shoot down... Oh, he's got a bunch of lasers. And we've got three... I think we should be fine. Maybe oh, this might do four damage. That might be a problem. But always this thing's fucking rails. There are better versions. Um. Okay, yeah, it looks like that does three damage, which is fine by us. Yeah, this thing goes ham. So the missile here. This laser is actually going to do work first. See what happens. Excellent. This can go here. This can go here. Bonk, 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 bonk. Ah, just a bunch. Ah. We'll just make sure this gets taken out. And dead. Excellent! Defeat the ship, scrap their ship. Oh, here we go. Oh, but well, we could have translated it anyways. Translator does the best to decipher the. Of Lake of the Ruins scribble across the wall of the Gunther Root. The output, fortunately, is legible, though you cannot say for certain its accuracy. Oh, cool. Nine months I have served aboard the vessel for Ambassador L. It is insufferable. Life in the slums of the Commonwealth, as grueling as it were, was more pleasant than this. I am treated like like a crystalline, a mortal. The royals have forgotten that we are that, that we too are word unknown, okay. I will not stand for this tomorrow. I will overthrow the ambassador. I will leave this place. The Commonwealth will rise. I will, it will prosper. I just know it. Hmm. Can I upgrade that? Okay. Well. Fed store. Let's see what happens. We're any translator, guys. That's what it does apparently. We didn't need it. See what they're offering. Do something aboard the ship. We've already run a salvage. Interact with the crewman. Ah, Alpha Ghoul. Um, we'll remove Alpha and give two ghosts. Oh, no, nah, we don't want to do that. We want to keep him as one at the moment. Hmm. Weapons are kind of fine right now. So we get a couple fixes, that'll do. Go to the quest now. Okay, a fairly large separate vessel is nearby, confirming that this is the correct location. Your approach um, seems to have alarmed the outlaws. Say, um, Bon Bon, does the Federation vessel strike you as out of place? Your assumptions are correct. The Federation vessel has recently been in contact with Harmony. Our own vessel's suspicions of malice are justified. Do what you came here to do. Um, two lasers. Where are their drones? I don't know. We'll get this defense up anyways. We'll go invisible. Just in case. Get our weapons charged up before anything happens. This should not be a hard vessel to destroy here. Through my husband informs me that this is will be a downfall. I do not wish to die. Please let us live. We will turn ourselves in. Allow them to live. Hello, surrender. You lock them up in cargo base. This is suspicious that the Wraith might attempt to escape. You wait for Agni to arrive. At last they do. They are very pleased. The Federation vessel has proven instrumental delaying outlaws. Raise chances of success by 75%, and we're likely the Hami will be request your assistance again. Cool. Excellent. Uh, exit. Explore. Attack and escape. We're not even going to need a defensive drone here. What the hell? Yeah, these, these ships with four to... Um, Uh, what should I call it? We will go invisible here real quick, just so this misses. There we go. Shoot there, shoot here. The laser will happen. Man, it does so much system damage. 
Uh, we just killed him. It's the rebellion. I mean, shut up. Militia encampment, central shell nebulae. Which one? I don't know which one I want to go to. Uh, still an upgrade. Let's get a cloaking up battery doors. Did we get a sheet? Oh, we definitely want the iron field for the shield. I should have done that ages ago. Alright, we'll leave it at just that for now. Militia or central net? Sh sh uh, like, so. I don't know which one I want to go to. Actually, I do. Let's go to the, let's go to the slug nebula. Yeah, I think I've got the militia one, I think. Potentially. Do something aboard, decoy. Let's delay him by two. Long range federation to stress score registered. Okay. Maybe this is one of the things as well. Okay. The shells involved in the same plan as the slugs, they were forced out by their much more aggressive cousin species, yeah. Cool. Um, blast our way through because we're not cloaking. These ships are usually more powerful, but, you know, it'd be like that. Um, we've also got invisible here. Yeah, there would be no... You un yeah, that's true. Oh, you're right, you're right. There wouldn't be an exclamation mark if I had already unlocked the thing. True. Maybe it's missed, that was kind of nice. Mind control is just so annoying to deal with. I just want to go off our oxygen system, but they're not really going to make it there. Visible. Man, how did that ABS hit? Jesus, that's annoying. That's why you need tinfoil hats. True. Laser! Do not really matter in the end, it looks like. We might have been in the cargo facility, we destroyed it, I don't care. More scrap, excellent. I wonder if I can upgrade. No, oh, no, the battery doors, drain control, no. That's okay. Increase them by 10%. We'll do this. Performance upgrades on our weapons. Yeah. We'll get the shield upgrade as well for one. Okay. Let's jump around. See what we can't find. Help the slugs. Defensive drone out. Blast these guys. Shields. This is going to be the only real problem. Everything else should be shot down by this, more or less. That was really annoying. A couple of my shots got shot out of the sky by their shots. Yeah, that's fine. You can just come here. Should be right. This laser goes first. Okay, you go there. You go here and you go here. Surrender, she can be right. We'll maintain defense, but your weaponry has proven effective. Yeah, we got that. Oh, the intruders on board, they're in our cloning bay. That is not ideal. Murder these guys, please. Okay. 
These guys repair like half speed, so the three of them in there are doing one. This thing is at four times speed, so he is much more better. That is for sure. Uh, we don't really need a store. All right, have a good night, Cape. I'll catch you next time. Let's just get this up. It's just so good. The one drone part just shoots so much shit down. This could be a problem if it ramps up, but I'm probably just not gonna let it ramp up. Laser, ooh, five fuel, but we really don't need it. Bonk, bonk, bonk. Excellent. Stress, nice. So if your health better is just hiding in a nebula, oh good, you must be back up and called. Uh, we're not, but we'll, we'll inspect. Massive painting and colors of an elite must be an important location. Hail the Mergoche peace. No need to murder these scientists. Let's do that. Oh, Federation, welcome to this beacon. What can I do for you? For you? you explain the situation, the shell seems to come. To contemplate for a moment. Oh, I see. My apologies. It has always been Shell's custom to study creatures who enter our space. We bring no harm to them, of course. We are simply bringing them aboard, run a quick few painless tests, and then send them on our way. We meant no harm. Don't worry. I'll have them released immediately. Okay. That's a big stealth ship. While well, the Shells are releasing the Federation's crew, you notice another ship signature has been detected. Suddenly, a large stealth ship jumps into the beacon. Ooh. They must be the Federation distress beacon. Ah, okay. Well, Shells don't deserve this. Protect them. That's fine. Defense drain up. Should be right. I'll probably present this alpha ghoul if I can to the um, judges. It's the first time I've seen one. Wow. Jesus. Neutral the stealth cruiser. You saved us, that's for the radiation ship though. You would betray your own people to save us. I'm not sure how to think about that, but I don't have any time to add uh, time to anyways. Please, I hope you allow me to come with you now that I cannot stay here. I will of course set fr free these men and send them back to their... Okay. Gynecology decrease. Oh, we got a dude. It cools down, recharges quickly, does less self damage, but generates less. Takes five times damage from asphyxiation on death, causes a breach. Okay. Mm, well, he's interesting. So I might just throw away one of my Manti. Because we got four of them. Just because he's an interesting dude. Okay, everybody back to your positions. Oh, well, you can go here. Okay, he's cool. Radiant. Wait, does he? No, he doesn't. I thought he might give a um, power, but he doesn't. Uh, we're gonna go to the Distress Beacon. Hopefully we can find whatever ship blueprint we're missing from here. Or I'm trying to save the shells. Okay. Again, defense training is good. I do think I need to upgrade my drone control two more. That way I can have this guy out as well. Okay. Or just don't shoot all the stuff that you're supposed to shoot. Whatever. Okay, this just... I hate this. Uh, no mercy. Okay. 
Okay. Mender, fix yourself, please. Visible here. You just heal. Nice. For some reason, okay. Um, hit the shield. Well, actually, no matter what I hit, but that'll do. Has the defeat scrap remaining? Nice. Let's take the remaining scrap. Bang, bang. I'm gonna go here, and then we can kind of work our way down and around, I think. Hail the shells. Tell them to leave them alone. Good, they did. Excellent. Um, did I get all of those shield upgrades? No, there's one more to do. Looks like. Another one, okay. We'll do that. Because now we got Ether Tech. Over shielding. Um, right? Ether shielding. Okay, so 54 and 2. Three more. So we go from 7, it'll go to 10. I think it's kind of worth doing. None shell personnel have identified your vessel under order directive, blah blah blah, sure. Whatever. Oh, gully dog, gully. You have no stealth stuff, so that's good. That's kinda lame. Alright, wait for this to go off. And you die. Nope. Mint. Been defeated. Scrap remains. Good. Good. I think we want to go around. Explore as much as we can. Ships turn and sneak away. They're through the nebula. You notice they're watching you stick it. Okay. No one to write out their location. Well, we'll get this out because it'll start taking down the shield. And what we'll do is take it down like this, and get this drain out as well. Wait for this shot to go one more time. Thank you. Bonk shield. Bonk. Dead. Oh, I'm dead. Now dead. Excellent. Let's grab the remains. Perfect. Yeah, we'll jump down here. We'll go around. I mean, I just... We need to go to as many beacons as possible for this place. Shell Sphinx aren't usually ones for direct combat. Sure, whatever. It doesn't really matter too much. This can come up. It's invisible as well, so their weapons don't charge. The mind control is not that strong. It's just annoying. Laser. Oh, my yeah. Deny their mercy. Bonk, 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 bonk. Shell's been defeated. Scrap the remains. Good, good, good. Kill that guard. That's fine. Get this up. Battery up. All these guys have ASB. I keep calling it ABS for some reason. I guess that's the thing for the cars. <laughs> the thing for the cars. Down, that's fine. Um, so you can come down, you come up, come in this. Yeah. 
Nice, there we go. Excellent. Oh, okay, yep, mm, that's fine. Then they come over here. We'll jump to the store. Because that's what we want. Hell the scientists. Hmm. Oh, we've got it. Okay, can't install the teleport because okay. Um, we'll upgrade our doors. Doors upgrades are always okay. Perform a task. We're going to run a salvage. Uh, we don't want to do that. Repair health. Yeah, we'll do that. That's fine. Okay. Yeah, we don't like you too much. You can be sold. Don't care about any of you or any of this. Yeah, no. Nah. Um, we will buy a couple of drone parts. Okay, heal up a little. As much as I would like to buy a few more of these, it's not really going to matter too much. Uh, okay, so how many jumps have I got? Six. So one, two, three, four, five is there. So we'll go around like this. That's fine. Okay. We should be okay with, with the time for that. We'll see. Okay. Oh, is this... Oh, no, it's not Lee. It's just the same shit. A free... Yeah, okay. This. Oh, you got a defense drain, that's kind of annoying. Send this all at once. Let's see what this is. Not, not um, as much as I would have liked. Um, we'll go invisible now. Because this beam will go off and we'll see what it does. Oh, wow. It does 10 system damage. I didn't realize that until literally just then. That's actually incredible. If that hits a system, it's just gone. It's gone. The system's gone. That's actually OP. It only does like one hull damage each thing, but the fact that it does the system damage is insane. Ah, uh, Labra the Hell, you're good visible. We have many people recently, which is rather unfortunate. So many new rebels coming. We've noticed that the outright wreath certainly strengths of toxin. Ah, oh, we'd like to test the effects this one on you aliens might have. We understand the risks and we'll pay a shell. Uh, we'll send this crew member in. Nice. Wish we could just keep buying power. Follow them. Ooh, what's big? Contact them. Request the trade. I think we're okay. I like the. I really like this weapon, but this is really good for us right now. So we're not gonna poke the bear, you know. Wow, that's okay. Uh, all right, let me think here. So. We're going to let the artillery do some work here, I think. These shields can be powered down for now. Let's get this missile launcher up. And let's get this out. And we may as well stealth from the get-go. Because this, hitting these systems and doing the 10 damage, the 10 system damage will be very strong for us, I think. Like, we don't need our shields up for the initial part until our overshields are gone, to be honest, so... Unfortunately, it didn't hit the shields there, but it's okay. Let's see the fight, and you're dead. Get oxygen back up. And then jump to the exit, and we'll get to the final sector, I guess. Explore. Uh, yeah, definitely get this you defense drain up. My man. I missed a few streams from work travel. How goes the FTL life? Well, it's good. You know, we played a couple of regular. This is our only second. This is our own. This is only our second stream of the multiverse. So, I really enjoyed it. I really do. It's excellent. It really is. Like the amount of effort that's gone into this game is insane. Did that missile just get shot out? It did. That's annoying. Oh, 
Wow, that was really lucky. Yeah. You're just messed up now. Not even gonna waste the missile. Nope. Bonk, bonk. But yeah, it's all good, man, if you miss streams. It happens. Okay, so we go there. Do I want to do anything else before? No, we'll just jump there. It's a safe location there. I've got nothing... Nobody to talk to, nobody to do anything. Doesn't look like it. Okay. We can go destroy the ship. Uh, yeah, deploy the things. Get the free, not that it matters. Uh, we want repairs. May as well get the full, do something. We'll get a salvage mission. Uh, judges are all the way over there, Jesus. Okay. So I guess we can do it and come back around. Okay, let's upgrade this. And then what we will do is we'll come into here. Go to cloaking and upgrade this twice. Because that now gives us four. Which we can use on that. Yeah, that sounds good. We'll keep the rest in reserve for now. Because we'll get some as we go. And the backgrounds are so nice. Do anything. Do you have long range jump upgrade for engines? No. But I should be okay. Um, because the, the, the main ship takes twice as long to go anywhere. You need four levels in engines. I could do that to be honest. That might be the go. To be honest, you might be right there. I'm just going to wait as long as I can here. Um, that way this charges up as much as possible. Because I think this is 20 seconds yet, which is this. So this will fire first. Hit those shields. Jesus, this... Oh my god. That's actually crazy. If that can hit the shields... Wow. The merchant move, that's fair. I think that might be the idea. Upgrade my engines. So if we look at the engine upgrade. Long range jump. I just need a little... Let me get my engines to four. Nope. Allows to jump to any previous visited beacon. Yeah, let's do it. That's worth doing here for sure. Specifically so we can get to the judges and back. I really don't want to fight Sullivan, so we won't. Hydra. First missile fires multiple low warheads at the price of one. It can shoot five. So this could be better than what we got here. Because that's only one missile. Does three damage. This can charge up for longer. And if we're waiting, it might be the go. I'm going to do it. I think the Hydra could be better. So we have the, um, like the system power for it. One, two, three, four, five. So is that enough? I think we're okay. So we go here, then it'll be three. So one, two, three. I think we're okay. I think we're exactly on the money. I think we're exactly on the money. Totally, I think, worth waiting for this. Maybe not for the missiles. Let's shoot the missiles. Then I'll wait for that. So 
That's a lot of shots coming my way. So one, two, three. Yeah, yeah, we're fine, we're fine, we're fine. Ah, uh, yeah, okay. That's annoying. Uh, technology. Present. Yeah, battery system. I don't know if I've done... Oh, I have done battery system before. Whoops. Well, that was a big waste. But that's okay. Stolen tunnel upgrade. Battery system. Battery cooldown is reduced by 80%. Onboard tech. Let's get a breach sealant. Ah, oh, look at that. We need some fuel. Fuck. Did I just kill myself by doing that? I might have. I might have just failed this from doing that. That's... Whoops. Hang on, let me think, let me think, let me think. Anything else I can do? Well, I think I just lose now, right? Because I'm an idiot. The base gets destroyed. And the base gets destroyed, right? Oh, wait, hang on. Or do I get another turn? It says zero turns. Do I actually get another turn? Yeah, okay. Never mind. I'm so dirty at myself, guys. I'm so dirty at myself. I can't believe I did that because I'm an idiot. Oh, I'm so stupid. I even wasted the trip to the judges. Oh, it's so dumb. It's the dumbest thing. Wow. So bad, I'm so sorry guys. Ugh. Oh wow, wow, wow.